It's past midnight. A light breeze wafts in, bringing the stink from the streets. I'd shut the window, but I can't bring myself to get up. My feet are killing me. Tailing aroused man for the last seven hours. I'm missing something. There's someone I here. I thought I told you to go home, reader. You did. I was just leaving. Your day just got longer, though. There's someone here to see you. Tell him to come back tomorrow. She insists on seeing you right away. Says her name's Miss Parker. Another one of your forgotten conquests, perhaps? I give Rita the proverbial death glare before asking her to send him my visitor. Miss Parker. Parker. Why does that name ring a bell? I am missing something. She walks in with an air of self-confidence. She's the prettiest damned thing I've laid my eyes on. And she knows it. Her sweet scent invades my senses. And for a moment, I can't think straight. I've asked Rita to leave, but she doesn't budge. There's a fierce determination in her eyes. She's a good girl. I'll thank her for it later. Right now, I need her to leave. Go home, me. Whatever you say, boss. She looks at me with amusement. There's something familiar about her. Something. I can't quite put my finger on it. The muted voice at the back of my head is trying to tell me something. A thought leaves my mind as I'm drawn towards her. I can't explain it, but something's pulling me in. Her gaze never wavers. She gives me a provocative look as her lips curl up into the hint of a smile. The scent burns through my nostrils. I can't resist. I don't care to. The temptation. The urge. It's too strong. unmistakably cold look in her eyes. Unequivocal. No hate or satisfaction, just a calm, emotionless gaze. 